Hello world, welcome back to another Pico CTF 2022 ride up video. In this video, we'll be walking through the forensics challenge, Operation Oni, worth 300 points. Let's get into it. Download this disk image file. Find the key and log into the remote machine. Okay, so this does require you to start an instance, which you can click right here, which we've already done so. And when you click that, it'll start up an instance and you'll get these two bullet points where you can download the disk image and log into the remote machine with this. And you'll need this in order to complete the challenge. And you'll see why here in a moment. But I've already downloaded the disk image file and I already have an autopsy case set up for it. So let's go ahead and open up autopsy. Open recent case, Operation Oni. Let that load up. Okay, bring that over to the side here. Now we're gonna wanna go to data sources, disk image, disk image, and then you're again, you're gonna wanna go to the big Linux partition, right? With all the Linux file system infrastructure inside. And then once again, we're gonna go to root, and then you'll notice that, okay, once again, we have a bash history set up here. And we can see that SSH keygen was ran with this ED25519. For that value, an SSH key was generated and we can see it here. Now we have both the public key here and the private key here, but what we're interested in is the private key because that's what we're going to be passing into the SSH command. We don't care about the public key as so much as the private key. That's that's where the money's at, okay? So how do we pull it out of autopsy? Well, it's very easy. All we have to do is right click and do extract files, and then we can simply extract it to wherever we want. So we can go to this PC, we can go directly into our Pico CTF 2022 folder, and then our Operation Oni folder. And we'll just save it there. Okay, now let's move on to the next step. So let's open up Kali. And we'll bring it over here. And we'll drag our private key over into the Operation Oni folder that I have set up over here. Then we'll open up our terminal and notice I'm already in here. We can do ls. All right. Now, all we have to do really is take this command, copy it, paste that. And then instead of key file here, we put our actual key file name, which is id underscore whatever, and then press enter. Wait for that to connect up. The authenticity of the can't be established. That's fine. So we'll just say yes. Okay, so we have an issue. It's asking for a password because our private key file is unprotected, which means its permissions aren't set up right. So the permissions right now are 766. So let's exit out of that and let's actually take a look at that further. So you'll notice that the owner has full read write execute permissions and then the group has read write and then everyone else has read write. We don't want those permissions for this file. If we go back to autopsy, we can actually see what permissions were originally set on the file. If we just go to the file metadata, we'll see that only the owner has read and write permissions which would be a value of six, right? Everybody else should have zero permissions to this file. So if we just mimic those permissions, right? So if we just do chmod six, zero, zero, and then our, of course, private key. Now, if we look again, we'll see that this matches this, aside from that R there, okay? That doesn't matter for this though. But now we have the same permissions essentially as what was in the image originally. So now we should be able to SSH back in without it having to ask us for that password or prompting us with that warning. And there we go, we're in. Now if we do a little LS, we can see our flag is right there. And if we just cat that out, we got the flag. Pico CTF, key sleuth. All right, if you enjoyed the video, drop a like and subscribe to the channel to show your support. Turn on post notifications to get regular injections of cyber content directly into your feed. Check out our Patreon, join our Discord, and follow us on Twitter. 
Links in the description box down below and leave any feedback or questions in the comments section down below. This is Almond Milk. Thanks for watching. Goodbye, world.